Hello everyone, this is Extraordinary. Welcome back everyone to another Extraordinary, the time at the start of our week where we take a look at the church's calendar and what's coming up. This week is the fourth week of Eastertide, another great opportunity to show our praise that Christ is risen. But the theme of this week is vocation, uh, which gives us a lovely opportunity throughout the week to think about the calling that God has for every one of us. This week we celebrate lots of saints, all with different callings from God. So we're going to start off on Thursday with the feast day of St. Catherine of Siena, Virgin and Doctor. To be a doctor of the church, it means that you contributed greatly to the understanding and thinking of the church. And St. Catherine of Siena certainly did do that. St. Catherine was born in the 14th century and was the 23rd child of her parents, which is mind-blowing. Uh, from a very young age, she showed her passion um, and spoke out against lots of different things that didn't quite make sense at the time. But when she was 18, she joined the Dominican Order and led a very co contemplative and secluded life. She attracted many followers throughout her life, lots of men, women, religious and lay people, uh, because of her holiness and the deep impression especially that she made on the Pope at the time. Throughout her life, there was one thing that she kept consistent, and that was her belief in surrendering her life to Christ. And now we move on to Friday to celebrate the feast of St. Pius V, who was a Pope. St. Pius was born to a poor family in Italy and was a shepherd until the age of 14 uh, when he joined the Dominican order. He rose to be Pope in 1566 and saw his main objective to be reforming the church and making sure that people didn't misinterpret the message of Christ. Finally, we move on to Saturday, which is the feast of St. Joseph the Worker. This feast is so important because it shows the importance of every vocation. St. Joseph was the earthly father of Christ, a role that we hear about so much, but that doesn't make it any less important. Joseph had a massive impact on those early years of Christ's life. Spend some time maybe thinking about what God might be calling you to do this week. We have some amazing saints coming up that were all called to, called to do different things and who changed so many people's lives. What is God calling you to do? I've been James and this has been Extraordinary. See you soon.